Hey guys, welcome back to some more Vitamin Y. So today is Tuesday. That means we're using Play Glitches U Bell. So, you know how I said that I was going to be taking off U Bell, beating Place in it with uh, Burning Abyss U Bell? Well, I made the deck. I kind of quickly slapped it together and all, but uh, it is there. So, um, I actually had to confirm something on uh, Wadger Pro. Uh, I was wondering if you would ever, you know, like miss timing with like Dark Greffer. So, if you go like Dark Greffer, discard a Burning Abyss, send it Burning Abyss, would you have missed the one that you sent? No, they both go off. So, I guess Dark Greffer can be kind of helpful, uh, which you know it's not helpful, drawing double malicious, that is not helpful, that's never helpful. Yeah, no, 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 You have a pretty high rating, so I hope you're not doing anything sacky, but I guess we'll find out. But yeah, drawing double malicious like that, that's cool. That's cool. That's totally what I want to do, is draw freaking militiae. Militiae? Maliciouses? Malicious Maliciouses? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going at with this. Alright, so how do I want to do this? I want to put the Mali on top, summon, yeah, so. We'll go play back. And put you on top of the deck, summon you back. Mali. Back. There we go. That way I don't get that. That so means I still got one more Mali in the deck, so that's good. That's good. Has a nice booty. Okay. Let me set this past to you. Okay. Okay, but I can just change its attack position next turn. So, that's not something I'm really concerned with. Alright. Alright, I guess that's fine. Oh, yeah. Oh, hold on. Let me turn defense mode. There you go. Before you lose your bra up in this bitch. Alright, so I'll go ahead and drop plate again. Simple as that. So I got two of them damn things. Like, okay, well, let me scrap a fact right now then. I'll go ahead and just blow this up. How about no flippy flippy? No flippy flippy. No flippy flippy. Okay, that's fine. Like, okay. Uh. Uh. I don't mind drawing that too, not really too bad, so I'll just I'll go ahead and go Mali effect first. And so you are, you're, you're starting to fall behind, so you're starting to fall behind the wayside. It's not looking good. It's like you got two of them damn things, like, you know, I don't even care. Oops, he vanished. Nope, they don't even care. Course bills. Course bills. Alright. Scrap attack. Well, I'm okay. Okay. That's fine. So, I know exactly what you have. I know exactly what you're going to draw. Yeah, this isn't looking pretty good. This isn't looking good for you, sir. Because I know exactly what you're going to draw into that Kokochi. Thing and I'm gonna go scrap, target bills, target your monster, blow them up. So at this point, you might as well quit. Yeah, you're so you're so deep in the hole that there's no possible way that you can come back. Scrap effect, target bills, and that. I don't give a shit about these. 
Yeah, look at your rating. Like, that's a pretty high rating. I thought I was gonna actually get a challenge here. You know, coming at me with this shit. I'm like, okay. Oh, I said, you're so deep in the damn hole. That's it. This is it. Like, you're too far behind. I'm just gonna blow that up. You ain't gonna get shit. Turn to attack, 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 and you're in top deck and then nothing, and I'm gonna win. Even Dark Hole won't save your ass, so. Uh. Yeah. What do you mean I can't? The fuck? I can target Beals. All I have to do. Exactly. So I would only destroy your monster. It's the only thing that needs to be. Resolved for scrap is the targets. I selected my two targets, destroy them, but I can't be destroyed by card friends, so I pretty much get a free pop off you. Really? Like, really? No. <sighs> like, really? I wouldn't lie to you. I don't need to lie to you. Like, please don't make me have to go fucking find this shit online. Oh, I put choice. Choose. Choose. Please. Why can't I use effect? Well, I, you're not specifying why I can't use my effect. Why can't I use scraps effect? I've been using scraps effect this entire fucking duel. Do I need to find you the inform information online? Let's put information on. Fine, be right back. There you go, sir. Right there. Beals, scrap, dragon, combo. Alright. Ah, uh, noobs. Sort of got. All I need to do is target. Like, who would have thought that your rating would be so high, yet you're such a noob? Like, come on. Come on. Come on. First grade, SpongeBob.
Never duel on DN. Never, ever duel on DN. Don't. It, it's just bad. Don't. Don't duel on DN. Don't duel on DN. Alright, I'm tired of this. Get another duel on. It, you saw his rating. It was recent, It was decently high. I thought I was actually gonna get some. I was actually gonna get a duel on, and he ended up just being a noob. Like, really? What is up with everybody lately? All right, go ahead and choose. You want to go first or second? Okay. Let's say, hurry that shit up. This hand is fun. Yep. But one off of YouTube. The the one, the famous, the only. Then not the only, probably not. Yep. Yeah, I got recognized. I can go with that. Yup. <laughs> Don't you be like, hi YouTube. I'm famous now. <laughs> Alright. He's gonna do is he gonna gores me? It's been such a long time since I've seen gores. I knew it! I'm on YouTube! Like, yes, you're on YouTube. Congratulations. I'll show YouTube that you're a pretty good duel lesson. Come at me. I need I need I need a challenge. I need I need a good duel. I it's going dry, the lake is going dry with good duels lately, I swear. Especially yesterday's video. Ooh, alright. Heretics. Oh, well, this is gonna be a good one. Uh yeah, that's fine. You got Wow, okay, that was anticlimactic as fuck. <laughs> I swear, that was and uh, he's like special summon heretic. I am my turn. Like uh, why? <laughs> like uh, Sure. Sure. Mm. I could do something interesting. I could sink into six, summon Goyal Guardian, run his ass over, take his ass, then limit reverse that. Oh, but I'd have to attack to do that play. Eh, it's not worth it. I could probably take him out right now. Wait, why did my. Why my shit get banished? Why is this banished? It's back in the grave. I just normal summon that. Thanks. Uh, so now, because I normal summon that from my hand, so I already normal summoned. Uh, I'll just go ahead and go Mali effect again. He can draw all the cards he wants. I'm not sure if he has anything to freaking block me in this fucking deck. Not that I know of, anyway. So. Plague effect. Go ahead and put you on top of the deck. Send you back. And sink. Eight. Draw a card. Draw. Sink. Eight. Nine. I'll say he can draw all he wants. I'm gonna try to end this shit right here, right now. I could go for Crimson Blader, but nah. I'll just pop his ass. Oh, okay. Okay. So you had the you had the veiler, see? So Alright. Bill's attack. Ooh, okay. I take your monster's attack. Oh, that was wrong. Back at 8,000. 
Oh, no, no, got the honest too. You're cool. I know. Okay. What's your point? Damn, it's got that honest, it's got that veiler. Nah, I'm cool. Go ahead. I didn't know you were going to get both the Onyx and the Villa. I was going to try to end it right then and there, but no, nah, you got it. I don't even know what that does. Oh, you're going to ritual summon the fucking bitchy bitch. Alright. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Sure. Why do you sense fear? <laughs> Alright, what'd she do? Just summon giant that discards it and on and on and on. Wait, I thought that was during the end. Who's the fact? During the end phase. Oh, oh, Tef knew what effect. Who's the fact? Okay. Yeah, rituals is attributed. That's right. I thought you were activating her effect. She probably specified. Alright, light has resolved. And so I guess in the end phase he's gonna go ahead and grab himself an honest. Alright, sixing. M7? Yep. That's fine. So now what? And they're all light. And I know they're any other things they can use Sophia and grab back that honest. Scared don't attack. Yep. Grabbing the Veiler back, I see. Okay, well, at least it's not honest. At least it's not honest. Because honestly, if it was honest, I'd honestly. Honest. The honest. Honestly. <laughs> no, I wouldn't, but honestly. Honest. I'm gonna normal summon. Back. No one Veiler him? Go ahead and drop you, Bell. It's about time to play with you, Bell, anyway. I kind of overextended and got my ass beat. I, I thought I could take him, but I'm apparently not. At least I don't have to worry about it, honest. So I clearly need to take out that M7. There's, like, there's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. So we're going to be go ahead and just running that over. Given that that's the whole scrap attack. Definitely. I'm not really worried about that, but I'm making you use the honest scrap effect. Target Armageddon and Sath. Go ahead and use it. I'm gonna make you use that. I'm gonna make you use that Veiler. All right, that's fine. But I want that Veiler. Go ahead. Is that during every end phase? During the end phase, it just covers just on the. I guess that's during every end phase. I did not know that. I th I thought it was just during his end phases. Yeah, 
Alright, that's fine. So he got back honest. Yeah, he got back honest. I did not. I didn't know it was spell speed too. I know nothing about Sephira. Okay. So, the turn that he sent a light monster from his hand or deck to a graveyard. So, he sent the Honest. So, I shouldn't even activate my effect. I did not know that. I misplayed. I misplayed pretty bad. Yep. I misplayed pretty bad. I did not know. That was just, that was bad. That was a misplay on my part. My bad, everybody. I didn't know. I didn't read it right. Totally didn't read it right. My bad. Yeah, that's fine. Mm-hmm. It's already normal summoned. Yep. Mm-hmm. I'd rather not have to use this limit verse right now, but I might. Nope, I did not know he was gonna have the honest and the and the veil. I didn't know he was gonna have both. I, uh, that was my bad. I should know extended. I thought I had it. Oh well. Now uh, he's got it. Let's try something you can target one monster here for a quick Target. Go ahead and detach. I didn't want to go off with that play. Really didn't, but he made me. I got I, I got to get you bell out of there. It's pretty clear I got to get you bell out of there. Oh, okay, okay. I thought it was the detached to that effect. Oh, yeah, he's got it because he can just once per turn, he can attack the turn to from this card, target one face up card on either side of the field, and send those targets to the grave. So he can just send you both to the grave. Or not. Alright, so here it comes. Here's that honest. Ow, oh, well, that's gonna hurt. That's 14 right there. And here's that honest. Gonna destroy me in my fucking life. Fucking ouch, just recycling honest, fucking ridiculous. And go ahead and grab the honest back. No, he wants to veil it back. Swear. My kingdom for fucking something. I don't got shit right now. Nope. I do not have shit right now. He's probably got it. He can probably summon something back and make like another M7 and bounce my ass, so. You know, and he can just veil me during my end phase. You know, during my end of main phase one. My end phase two. So, yep. I got nothing. I should not have overextended. I shouldn't have. Mm 
Okay. I really thought he was gonna veil her. I really thought he was gonna veil her. It's a pretty good ritual card, just being able to block shit. Didn't he have two of them? Oh, he got it back from the graveyard. That's right. That's right. The preparation of rights. Damn. Go into another damn mask. I can't do shit with it right now. Mm-hmm. Alright. You got another one in your hand? You just gonna rip Joe summon another one? No? Okay. Damn, and I'm not still not drawing what I need to be drawing. Like, come on. Come on, I need like a dark. I need any dark. Still can't really play, actually. Damn. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead and get your veiler back or whatever you want back. That's fine. I have no response for that. You got Gauntlet Launcher, whatever the fuck his face is? Oh, he's got that one. Okay. That's fine. And damn. Every single time I try to do a damn play, this guy's like, nope, I got the answer right here. <laughs> oh, well, it's a good duel anyway. Oh, let's see with those two. Okay. You got that launcher guy? You can pop both of them. Yep, that's it. You got it. You got it. GG. This video is already 28 minutes long, it's fine. I know, I know, I'm so lucky, I know, woo, luck! I know, I got it, I know. At this point, I'm not even phased by it. Alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of uh, Vitamin Y. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with you, Balaxis. Thanks for watching.